to create a quote, go to a sale or opportunity. You can pull up a list of sales here, or you can quickly create a sale or an opportunity from the quick create or the company view. Right now, we're on a sale called website build, and it's currently in the quote requested phase, which means it's probably a good time to send out a quote. We can create a quote from here, or we can hover down to the left-hand side to see all the previous quotes that we've sent out, as well as create new ones. Here I'm going to call it website design. The quote manager is often the account manager or new business exec, but sometimes it might be a project manager like Allison. Next, we can select a quote template. If we're quoting for just time and materials, we can do that here. If it's a more of a fixed fee, we can select this one. You can create different types of quote templates here from the quote template list. There are three steps in creating and sending out a quote. And the first one is to create an estimate. An estimate is a project plan that can have things like timeline and budget. It doesn't necessarily mean that we're sharing it on the quote, but this project plan that we create here can automatically turn into a live project when the quote is accepted and completed. Oftentimes, we're seeing customers use the project templates to pre-populate a quote. In this case, I'm going to use the website digital agency template to populate all the milestones such as design and development with the respective timelines. From here, I can edit and change the timelines as well as the specific tasks. Let's say in this case, it's not gonna take 15 minutes, it's going to take, or 15 hours, it's gonna take uh, 20 minutes for this particular client. And instead of $120, they're a long-time customer of ours, so we give them a discount on design. Beyond these services, we can add materials. Oftentimes, a digital website would include server and testing, but if we're selling any hardware or we're pulling on perhaps a video director, we can add them here. Maybe they're working for us uh, for five days, and we're selling that service for $200 a day. The next step is creating content. And from the quote template, you can already predefine the content that you want to include. So in this case, we already have a custom introduction with fields here from the right hand side that will pre populate once we create the quote PDF. And I can put in more context here as well. The project plan can have templated descriptions, as you see here. As a reminder, I'm going to put the title. The conclusion can be templated. Oftentimes, we're seeing customers use scope of work and a bit of an explanation of what's involved for this specific quote. And then lastly, the terms and conditions can be templated for different types of work. In this case, is a website design, so we might have a specific TNCs for here rather than an on site visit in a workshop. Might have different terms and conditions, especially around expenses like travel and lodging. Then, lastly, it's time to send this quote out to the potential client, or maybe it's a current client. And here, the PDF template can be defined in the quote template, but I can also edit and change the design here as I go through it. So we have styles like the text and the colors. We have what's included in the services description. Since it's a fixed bid project, I'm just showing the scope of work, but I'm not showing any prices. But if I did want to include those, I could. Next step is the materials section. Here I'm not showing any materials, but since I'm hiring a director for this, I'm going to include those. going to include taxes and then send this out.
This email can be templated as well, but I might want to put in more explanation or an extra thank you here. And then shoot this email out to the customer. We can include the PDF and we can also include a client portal link where they can come to the client portal and accept or decline the quote. I'm going to do that on behalf of the customer. Alton gave me a phone call right after I sent the quote and says, hey John, it looks fantastic. And then the last step of the quote is to then convert this into a project. So we can take a quote from the sales side of Excello convert it automatically into a project, and then the project and delivery team can take the quote and start delivering on that project plan that we put together before sending it out. So here we have the exact same project plan on the project side.